Hey, this is Dada and Little Guy, and today we're gonna go see Thor! Thor, Love and Thunder at AMC Theaters in Disney Springs. Yeah. All right, so when we last left off in this timeline, it was Endgame. Thor hopped onto the ship, the Guardian ship, and we opened up Guardians of the Galaxy over the summer. If you haven't been on that ride, you can go check out the card right there to see what it was all about. But today, tonight, this weekend, it's all about Thor, Love and Thunder. I'm most excited about this because uh, Thor gets all back in shape and stops being sad Thor and starts kicking some ass again. So this is interesting. Let's see if uh, the tradition of saying goodbye to some of our favorite characters continues or if we're going to continue to watch Chris Helmsworth as Thor in the future. Of course, just like every other opening weekend, you can come down here and take your picture in front of the cool premiere stuff. There's signs all over the place. Oh, I also forgot to mention last time I was here, but there's a new thing over here called Summer House on the lake. The pictures make it look like it's a restaurant, or it could end up being a place to take a boat out onto the water. We don't know yet. More information will follow on. What's all this stuff on the ground right here? Oh, that's what Thor's hammer. That's what Thor does with his hammer? Creates lightning? Cool, man, let's go. Let's go check this movie out. Whoa, Thor Love and Thunder, man. We got Natalie Portman, Psycho Wakiti, Chris Helmsworth, and Tessa Thompson. Uh, this movie will also introduce Christian Bale as the bad guy. All right, we gotta go grab our popcorn. Is this the large, this is the biggest one they have? I guess so. Let's go check this movie out. All right, so, Yes, that was an awesome movie. A lot of great plot twists. A lot of new things are set up for the future. You're always going to get a spoiler-free review from me. So I will tell you this and only this. Two thumbs up. Definitely check it out this weekend. If you get a chance to see it down here at Disney, all the better. There was also a super healthy dose of GNR. So <laughs> the name Axel is probably going to be famous again pretty soon. <laughs> and of course, no trip to Disney Springs is complete without seeing a movie. Taking a kid over to the M&M store. <laughs> Paying $20 for $2 worth of M&M's and then swinging in and telling them no that they can't have any of the toys over at Marvel Superior Headquarters store. <laughs> what are these things, dude? Whoa. These are like gingerbread They look like gingerbread men? It's Groot. It's a Groot plush. This is all, it's a whole wall of Groot stuff, man. We got Awesome Mix. You can buy an Awesome Mix volume, whatever you want. That's Baby Groot, that's right. Do you like Baby Groot? That's just my Baby Groot. That's just my Baby Groot. They got a whole big wall of spider putter stuff in them. And I'm digging this old school vintage style that they're moving to with all the designs on these shirts. The Hydra Stomper and Steve Rogers. Wow, you know who Steve Rogers is? No. It's Captain America, dude. I don't know, that says it's the Hydra Stomper. And if you're worthy, you can try to buy one of these awesome Thor hammers. Whoa. Or a really cool hat. It says New Asgard Tours. What did you think of the movie? Did you like it? Yeah! Yeah? Would you go see it again? Yeah! How many thumbs up do you give it? Two thumbs up from Little Guy! Yeah! <laughs> Thanks for watching, everybody! We can't wait to go on another princess! Yes! And the two goats. Do you remember the two goats? What sound? What sound do they make? You don't know. They always are. Wah!